morning. So I am making over um, what used to be the living room in my apartment. I'm turning it into a dining room. I don't really use a living room. I don't watch TV or anything, um, but I do like hosting little get-togethers or little Christmas parties and stuff. So I do want to have um, a dining table in here and there's no room for it unless I use this space. So I found this really nice wooden dining table. It's very heavy. I actually almost broke my hand moving it in here and I only paid $250 for it. The cushions do need reupholstered. I think they had cats, which I do too, but I also just don't really like the pattern. And I found this really, really pretty um, upholstery fabric from Fabricville and it was only $7 a yard. So I'm going to reupholster the seats. And I'm not a huge fan of the green. So what I think I'm gonna do is I'm going to paint them black. And I've used this brand of paint before, the Bear Marquee brand, and I just got two samples. I painted um, cabinets with this before and it held up really well. So I definitely recommend it. I did do a little fireplace makeover in another video, but I think that I'm going to actually repaint the top of the mantle white. I'd like to put a nice big piece of artwork up there. I'm also trying to decide um, if I want to have a buffet over here or if I want to put one on this wall. I did have a buffet here before. So I'm still shopping around. I did go to the thrift store and I picked up some things as well. I found a piece of artwork that I really liked at Valley Village. I also found a really pretty ornate white mirror, some curtains that were the perfect length for the window. I also bought a rug off of Amazon and it came last week. This is the first time ever that I've not opened a rug as soon as I got it, but it's just because I don't want to get paint on it. So I'm going to hurry up and paint the table so that I can actually look at this rug. I am losing daylight fast. Um, I'm definitely not gonna get all the chairs done today. I did finish the table and it's dry. I really wanna get the rug down today. And in case you're wondering, the previous person had painted all of the green parts with chalk paint, which is why I'm not priming or sanding. Um, it's already a rough surface, so I'm just painting over it. So it obviously needs to flatten out a bit, but I am so in love with the colors and it's nice and big so that when you pull out the chairs, you're not gonna get stuck on the rug. I'm using this rug kind of as like the inspirational palette for the rest of the space. So I love like the light blue cause that goes with the wall. Um, I'm bringing in some navy with the art. And ideally, um, if this was like my permanent space, I would have like wainscoting and wallpaper. And since I can't really do that, or I could do it, but I, you know, I don't wanna really invest a ton of money into this place. Um, it's nice to bring in like a really fun pattern with a huge rug. If I had a staple puller, I would have done it the right way, which was to take off the old fabric, um, take out all the staples, and then put on the new fabric. It's really just adding extra cushioning is how I look at it. <laughs> okay, so I'm just getting off work and it's been a few weeks. I have the tables and chairs done. Um, I was just kind of working away at them while I ordered some other things for the room. I wasn't sure what I was going to do on this huge wall, but um, I found this Monet painting on Facebook Marketplace for only $50. It's a little hidden at the bottom. If you guys watched my Boston video, my travel video, then you'll know that I went to this Impressionism exhibit and they were doing uh, an exhibit of all the Monet paintings. And I really fell in love with his lily pad paintings. And within the same week, I found this Monet print at Value Village for only $20. And it's another really 
peaceful, pretty painting that I like. So I have this buffet on the floor. I got it from Wayfair. I had to take it all out of the box and bring it up basically piece by piece because it was way too heavy to carry. I overestimated how much I could carry. And I got this during their Black Friday sale. It's a lacquered green buffet. I also purchased this really nice brass bookcase that I'm gonna put in one of the corners of the room. I'm actually hosting a little Christmas dinner party. I'm actually hosting a little Christmas dinner party this weekend. Kitty cat! Literally every time I go to speak, my cat is clawing in the cat litter box. So I'm actually hosting um, a little Christmas girls dinner party this weekend, and I can't wait uh, to have this space finished and for them to see it. Oh my gosh, oh wow, <laughs> love it, love it, love it.